the Isle of Skye, a land famous for its untamed beauty. Its rugged cliffs, swirling mists and majestic mountains create a one-of-a-kind landscape that you'll never forget. This is the story of a road trip that we embarked on when we first met. And before I upsize to this beast, in this story I still have this, another, albeit smaller beast, the VW T6.1 California Ocean. This trip took place in 2021. It was the first time I'd ever taken the Danny to Scotland, and to say we were excited was a bit of an understatement. <laughs> I'm not used to it then. As we're going on an adventure in the camper van to the... I love Sky. <laughs> <laughs> Now any trip to Sky is not just about the island itself, it's about the journey to it as well. It's one of the few places in the UK where the scenery leading to it is just as stunning as the island itself. If you're planning a trip to Scotland and you want to do the most beautiful Scottish road trip, then don't do the NC500. Instead, there's a much better alternative. An alternative where you'll cover Scotland's very best scenery starting near Glasgow and doing a beautiful loop up to the Isle of Skye and back again. You'll drive through the best valleys, visit the most dramatic mountain scenery, see the best white sand beaches in the UK and to make it even better you can do the whole thing in as little as three days. I've made a guide for this trip that I've aptly named the ultimate Scottish road trip. The guide covers everything from services, places to eat, the best places to visit, our favourite overnight parking locations as well as our personal top five favourite things to do. And to make the guide even better it's available for only four pound. However, if you want to pick up a proper bargain, then I have a bundle of all four of my guides, which includes not only the Ultimate Scottish Road Trip Guide, but also my guides for the Cairngorms, the Island Mole, and the beautiful Isle of Arran. This incredible bundle is available for the small price of £10. The links for the guides are in the description below. And now back to the adventure, where we'd eventually made it to Sky and decided to stop off at a waterfall. After a brief stop off at the waterfall, we headed north. We were tired, it was getting late, and it was time to set up camp for the evening. Canny little setup, isn't it, babe? I did. What are your thoughts on Sky? It's lush. It's dead beautiful, isn't it? I've had a busy day. You're tired, aren't you? I was, but I've got a new lease of life now that I'm here and I've got food. Who's got a cheese fetish? So slightly mm. over the top. Slightly. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. Just to everything else. The sun. The sun set beautifully. There's no one else inside. We're all packed, pretty much. Ready to go. We didn't get up for sunrise. I was up there, ready to go, but. Someone turned the alarm off. <laughs> Accidentally. Didn't know who it was. It's a common it's a common thing that alarms occasionally do drop off by themselves. That'll do with me. We're going to see Quarang. 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 Whatever it's called. Today is going to be a fantastic day. That and tell. What do you think of here then, babe? Quite a beautiful <laughs> Look at it, man. Unreal. Trying to walk backwards down there, I'd rather you not fall to your death. I think she likes it. Whoa. She nearly died. Holiday. Another bad place to just chill. What's left in worse places? You will have. Some 
close ups of it. Scan a picture of my tree. Scrambled egg. Just wanted to tell the camera that that was the best scrambled egg I've ever had. What do you think? Do you think it looked like the best scrambled egg? It looked kind of good. You know what you did? You what? allowed it to set first for a little bit before you stirred it. You didn't go. You didn't scramble it before you put it in. That was the trick. And a little bit of chili spice. A bit of chili. Mm -hmm. A multi chili. I put you up here. Hmm? I put you. You didn't quite slam the door. Oh, enough. sorry. Was that too hard? Okay. <laughs> not quite the old standards, was it not? Why did I go now? Fucking bush. Yeah. <laughs> Danny had found a castle on Google Maps, so we decided to head there where we found actually one of the coolest looking swords I'd ever seen. After leaving the castle we headed here. This is Nice Point Lighthouse. Nestled on the north of the island, Nice Point Lighthouse is one of the most scenic views on the Isle of Skye and on this day it didn't disappoint. When we returned to the van we found that the boot was completely open and then to make things even worse Danny decided to mock me finely tuned and perfectly organised itinerary. Right, we're in Sky, okay? Oh, well. no, no time scales. However, Sloan wants to rush around everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, we've got to be somewhere by a certain time. <laughs> <laughs> well, we don't have to be. Exactly, we're washing some dishes. Do you like? <laughs> <laughs> However, he thinks we've got to be there by four o'clock. What time is it? Oh, five o'clock, we've got to be there. <laughs> I'm gonna be set off five. She's getting up. left in that in the sky to be honest. I'd tell them what I'd done. What? Oh, we went, <laughs> went all the way down to the lighthouse and we had a nice little view set up there. Took our time, took our merry little time. Really, really Again. took our time. Again, no time no scale. No time scale. We got back and I thought, that looks strange. Because she left the boot open, got everything in there, all of my camera sh I nearly sh myself as well. Oh All my of me, me laptop, the lot. But, <laughs> but, <laughs> oh god, yeah, everything was still in place, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> that would have been a fast way to end the relationship. All that love would have just gone sucked out. <laughs> <laughs> We had arrived at our second night camping spot ahead of our trip to the fairy pools the next day. At this camp spot we done the only thing you can do when you own a camper van that's got no shower. We had a wild wash. Living the real camper van life. We've got sliders on outside. We can only mean one thing. Ready? Let's go! What's your thought on wild washes? I really liked it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was nice actually. And you've uh, shaved your pits inside the <laughs> lot. Look at that. Nearly stopping me. After a good night's sleep, we had breakfast. Danny done the dishes and then we drove to Fairy Pools where Danny immediately had a nightmare. For a pool, and she's just dropped her phone. Oh, no. And she broke it, broke her phone. <laughs> you broke? Uh, just as well as the cover screen. You oh, broke man. it. You broke That's what it? you get for trying to run and show off. So the bro. Yeah. 
just how it beats when you put your hands on me. Time goes fast, but yet so slow. I leave all thoughts, yeah, I let them go. Cause I'm here with you. And all I need is you. What do you think the fairy pearls? I'm a little underwhelmed. Honest. Well, I'm underwhelmed by that postcard. It portrayed it as this like, yeah. wow. Well, but it was really nice, so to be fair. It was pretty, but it wasn't as vast as I expected. No, but yeah, I enjoyed I the little scrambling. Oh. I thought it was going to look like Crotway Leisure Centre back in the day, to be honest, and it didn't. Hungry after our semi disappointing hike to Fairy Pools, we stopped off for a spot of lunch. I'm on for pepperoni pizza with fries, minus a salad. I need to think about this one because we'll get fish and chips later. Presume we're not. Because we're nowhere near where that'll be. Presume this is the last meal of your life. This is the most unbelievable thing that she's ever bought us. Would you like a bite? Mm. Mmm. Mmm. I've tried the cheese skirt as well. Mmm. Not the bit well trotted. Mm. After lunch, it was time to begin the drive south, and as usual, I'd spotted some deer at the side of the road, grabbed my camera, and took off in hot pursuit. Get it? Oh, no. I've got some photos of them, but. The, no. the wind quick, isn't there? The wind was blowing down now again. So the bofters. <laughs> Gotta wash me pits. I thought I'm shit hot at getting away from you. Uh, As we headed south off the island, it was time to find our next overnight park up. We had high hopes, hopes that would be completely shattered when after driving for hours, I gave up and pulled over to the side of the road to spend the night in what felt like an absolute scrapyard. So we have just arrived, haven't we, darling? We have. At yeah. camp. Number three. Um, camp cracked in. Hi, camp cracked in. <laughs> and signified by the uh, old sink and whatnot over there. Couldn't find anywhere nice on Sky, so we just thought we'd start driving back. <clears throat> hi, hi. I thought we'd just try. Start driving back um, and just find somewhere where we did. So we found it. I've been bathed by my loved one. I felt like I was in a nursing home. <laughs> Come on, Barry, we we're just going to wash your balls, Barry. Um, well and truly bath. I you really liked it. I loved it. And it's uh, Dirty no, Danny's it, turn. It was more like um, the Roman bath. Oh, oh. The Roman, it was now like the fucking Roman bath. So it was like fucking Barry in the care home. Like, lift your leg up, Barry, so I can get your balls. <laughs> um, and we're going to have. What about the dry down? The most vigorous try down I've ever had, to be honest. And then she started kicking mud at us to try and get us dirty again, so she washes again. A little tinker. Um, so I last night, and then we're going to push off in the morning, so we're going to have some nice food. I'm going to get Larry and have a couple of Budweiser's. And then... Uh, that's it, isn't it? Yeah. Come on, put that down, get yourself... Get me one. I'm cooking, sorry. No, you're not. 